She means business with her pizza, okay? She means business. Like, I love that. And thank you so much, Bat Hat, with our generation for sending me. Can you see this? All of this stuff for free today to share with all of you. I mean, I have dolls, I have a stretcher, play sets, outfits, and this giant ambulance that, yes, makes lights and sounds. Like, I am blown away, and I cannot wait to get in, get in and play with all of this stuff with all of you. I have so much stuff to show you, but look, oh my gosh crazy let's start off with this ambulance I'm doing freehand now with this camera uh, <laughs> we got lights and you can just have lights or you can have lights and sounds oh my god this is amazing and then look inside right all right now these are the buttons inside are you ready all right so look a GPS light how cool is that also windshield wipers yes and then Yes, that is so cool. That is so cool and so interactive. And then look, once you're inside, like this thing is massive. Like look how big this is, like it's crazy. Uh, look at all of these pieces inside. <gasps> is that a defibrillator? Isn't that what that's called for your heart? Oh my God, it's so crazy. I love the little cones because you gotta be safe. You gotta be safe. Uh, chicken pox stickers so you can make them have chicken pox. Look at stethoscope. Like, oh my God, this is so, oh my God, like look, a little oxygen machine light up oh it lights up that's crazy and then it has gauze and a tank and look at the little bottles gloves again safety first love all the drawers for storage look all the drawers up there for storage this is crazy to me i love the back even look little heart lights on the back of this the doors do open on the back so you can come in from the back or from the side of this ambulance as well it does seat a doll in the front the wheel let's see the wheel turns yes wheel turns on this the wheel turns and are you ready it's a horn works. <laughs> I love it so much works on this. Like, I'm sorry I'm just so crazy and excited and jumping the camera around, but this is just so cool. I feel like if someone's really wanting to be a doctor or get into medicine, I think this is a great toy to someone for someone to play with. Also, as a doll person, collector myself, I love the details of all the little pieces. So if you're doing, let's say, doll photography, you can really get in there and make this look so cool. And the back here, look, it even has this long piece of stretcher in there. And then let's say, all right, so someone gets injured, sad incident, right? But look, if they go to the hospital, you have an outfit. This is the hospital stay. And this comes with little footies, a little hair cap. Obviously you have to have your gown. And it comes with like, oh my God, a little like bracelet, the hospital bracelet, patient form. I mean, the detail on these things are just insane to me. I just really love that they give so much thought into play. Because you know, like we see so many toys nowadays where it's like, it comes with like a tiny little sticker, right? No, this comes with bottles and like the little footies, which you normally wouldn't even think about having that with a doll hospital piece, but it comes with it. I love that. And then they have so many other accessory packs. So they have, of course, the large play sets. Of course, we have outfits. We also have these, which are amazing. These are the healthy checkup little ones. These are about $8. I've seen at Target most of the time. And I think that's such a great price for, look, a stethoscope, Inject. Look at the little temperature gauge. Oh my God, that is so cute. A medical form. Oh, is that blood pressure machine? A blood pressure machine. Oh my gosh, I love this. I love, I love, I love it. So you have so many different options. So let's say you don't want to go with the larger, bigger playset. It's big. I get it. Not everybody has this much room in their house for something so large, but you can still have the interactive play when you buy the little sets to go with your dolls because then you can, you know, still play doctor without having to go with the big places. So there is a lot of versatility with this stuff. I love that. And then this one, this place that they sent me was so cute. Here, let me show you guys. So cute. It is the Comfy Recovery. Comes with little, oh my God, the crayons, a coloring book, chocolates. Look at the detail on the chocolate. Each little piece of chocolate has the little like decoration on top to make it look so real. It comes with a rose flower mouthwash because you know, gotta be fresh even when you're at the hospital. Um, face mask, doll face mask. Oh, I love this so much. And the balloon, this is probably one of my favorite ones out of all the pieces that they sent me because of the chocolates, the face mask. Like this is something I would want if I was in a hospital. Like this is just, again, detail. 
one oh look healing in pink so let's say you break your arm you know it's happened to so many it comes with a cast a pen that you can washable on there that is insane an x-ray of your hand like this is too cute this is so perfect i think like this is so perfect for like let's say a child that does break their arm that's scary you know it really is it's even scary as an adult but as a child like it's so frightening so you can give them this for their doll and their doll can recover with them to me this is just so i, I can't get over how much i love the x-ray I want to show you some more hospital pieces before I go into the dolls and then we start unboxing. We have this OG Medicare. Love that. It comes with like, see that one comes with like a little carry stretcher. This one is a full on stretcher with wheels. Again, another blood pressure machine, another neck brace. We're getting, oh, look at the little tape and the scissors. Like, this is just so, so cute. I love it. Look, it actually like folds down like a real stretcher would. Like, again, so adorable, so detailed. I love that they thought of so much as well. Like even, like I said, for the folding up and down of this, for the gauges, for the blood pressure machine, like even has numbering on there. So if somebody, like I said, wants to aspire to be a doctor, they really can live in this beautiful world and practice and learn and, you know, just really experiment and see if that's what they want to do. I, I love that. I absolutely love that. This is so detailed and something that I feel like if I had as a child, you know, some years ago, would have maybe aspired to be something different. So this is really just so well done. Like I said, this is called the Medicare, Medicare kit. And this fits most 18 inch dolls. Keep that in mind, everyone, as we're looking at all this. Don't feel like you have to go with an OG doll because there's so many different options out there for 18 inch dolls this is just really cute because you can you know use it with other ones so you can really get into these play sets um i love the little backstory here i'll let you read that you can pause it if you would like this is our time this is our story that's so cute side note my hair looks different because this is the next day because <laughs> the camera ran out of battery so here i am the next day a little bit more spaced out in the background let me know how you guys like this versus something more closer so i wanted to show you some of the dolls that they sent me as well they sent me two that work really well with the ambulance and all the other sets that i showed you earlier so this doll right here unfortunately didn't have a good day and injured her leg has a broken leg comes with crutches a mask socks an x-ray for her broken foot, which goes with that place that I was showing you for the x-ray with the broken arm. I mean, you could put both casts on the doll. So, oof, they must have had a really tough time. <laughs> a broken arm and a broken leg at one day, like not a fun moment at all. So I just really love, again, the detail for it. I like the actual cloth, the different layers of fabrics in these dolls because they are not just a printed on fabric. We know on this channel, I talk about it all the time. We do not live or stand for printed on fabrics. They're just not cute. They're not. So with this brand, they're actually giving you detail in the fabric. Now, another thing with these dolls, they do have the sleepy eyes. So here I'll show you down and up. <laughs> eyes closed, eyes open. So we actually do have the sleepy eye, which we do see in, I would say like half of the 18 inch dolls do them, not all of them, but about half of them do that. So if you like that, these dolls actually do that as well. They do have rooted lashes and they have such pretty eyes on these too. There's a lot of design within the iris and pupil of the eye. Cause I don't like when dolls are just like solid color. Cause it kind of makes them look almost like I don't know, a little creepy. <laughs> when they have a little bit more detail, it makes the eye look more real. So it makes it look, give it more of a humanization feel to the doll. But of course, you can't always be the one that's injured. <laughs> there has to be a doctor or a nurse or someone there to help you get better. So with this one, we actually have a doctor. So with this one, like I said, she's the patient. And then with this one, she's gonna be the doctor. And I love the detail again on these. They come with x-rays, comes with a little like actual, oh, it actually lights up. A light up scope for your hat. Ah, oh, that is so cute. <laughs> I didn't know it actually lit up and she has great eyes. It's like greenish brown hazel. Comes with a mask with little flamingos on it. So a little decor, a little decoration. I like that. We just don't want a simple mask. We want something fun. Uh, the scrubs look very real. And she even has, which is not my personal style, but in a hospital I could see it. She's wearing Crocs. Like, Crocs, how ridiculous is that? Again, the detail, look at the Crocs in there. That is so funny. Oh my gosh. And like each one has a little story on the back as well. So this one is Sierra. This one is gonna be Martha. Uh, <laughs> again, if you really wanna get into 
practicing into the medicine field. <laughs> I feel like this is really a lot of fun and the detail on all these is so cute. She even comes with little gloves. Uh, but of course you can't just always be, you know, injured or be a doctor. You know, I mean, there's, there's other things to the our generation world. Again, this is a lot of the newer stuff that's out. So we have a lot of, you know, play sets related to that, but they also have and they sent me three of uh, their other outfits that are out. And these are I'm so excited for. So let's start off with the ones with the little dogs on it. This is Puppy Love. And they come with a headband, stockings, shoes, and of course an outfit. Look how cute that is. Look at the print. Look at the design. I love it. I love that the knitting on the stocking isn't just that hard fabric. It actually has like really good thick. It's like, I keep saying human. I mean, I mean, it does not a doll piece. Like it's an actual like real like heavier material to it. Here is the puppy love outfit. We also have, ah, this one's so cute. It says pizza forever. And this one comes with a little bit more. So some of their outfits are just the outfit with a few accessories. Sometimes it'll come with the outfit with even more accessories, as you can tell by the packaging being a little bit bigger. And this one says pizza's my BFF, my secret pizza recipe, which the notebook is actually spiraled. It is a real spiral. So it's not just a piece of paper folded, which we see a lot with doll stuff. No, it's a spiral notebook, shoes, skirt, glasses, stickers, and a pen. She means business with her pizza, okay? She means business. Like, I love that. She's so cute. I love the fun little tie in the front. We do see that in fashion. I've cut my shirts that way before. The fabric isn't just like a thin little polyester. No, this is so cute, so cute. And my favorite one, my favorite outfit that they sent me. It's like they know me or something, right? Uh, <laughs> this one is called Travel Chick love to travel and let's see she gets better you know she gets better she recovers from her broken leg she's like i want to go out and travel and see the world or let's say you know the doctor's like she didn't i need a vacation it's rough out there you know these people are our first responders they're out there helping us there are you know saviors right now in this world and she's ready for a vacation once what's going on in the world slows down and she's gonna get her little passport her airline ticket her glasses her, her like i'm sorry like look at this Look at this leopard jacket. I'm just ranting right now, aren't I? This striped shirt. I'm not a fan of the boots, but I really love this jacket. I am living for this jacket so much. She is ready to travel. Now, one thing with all the packages for our generation, they are recycled materials. Yes, recycled materials. I said this with the Glitter Girls review. If you haven't seen my Glitter Girls doll haul, definitely go watch that. This one, again, quality is there with the pieces and the fabrics and the toys and also their packaging like I said is recyclable and they use soy ink so again unless you're a cat <laughs> that plays in a box most of the time you throw all this packaging away so I really like that they are aware of what's going on in the planet and they are taking care of it in a small way <laughs> I mean it's still a big way but they're trying to do something at least they're not just giving us more waste with these packages. Oh, all right, enough chit chat. I feel like we've been chatting and chatting and chatting in like 10 minutes in the video and I haven't even like, let's go in, open some stuff and review it. Got her out of the box. Look how stunning her eyes are. I love her eyes and I love how she has her mask on and she is safe and ready to go out. I think she's so pretty. Like I, I love this profile on her. So good. I love the hair here. We're gonna do a little free camera, flying around camera. I feel like I'm on a drone or something. Um, <laughs> like look at the color of this hair. I love it. it's like almost like chocolate brown mixed with black in it. It's very, very soft. Like literally so soft to touch. Like I don't like that it's a little bit of like the rooting at the top here. Let me get a little better camera angle. See that isn't cute and it falls over. But overall the hair though does have a very nice silkiness to it. It doesn't feel brittle. It doesn't feel like some of those doll hairs where you get it and it's just like, it feels like, I don't know, like waxy. It does not feel like that. It feels really, really nice. I love the scrubs on this doll. So cute. Look at the little Crocs in love with this because it's just so detailed. Now these dolls, if you're not familiar, have soft cloth bodies and then the bendable rubberized arms. Um, Good weight to her though. She doesn't feel too, too light, but she doesn't feel as heavy as of some other 18 inch dolls that I've played with. So for me, she's kind of like in the middle when it comes to like the overall weight. Now look how cute she is with 
this ambulance she's ready to save some lives that is what she she's ready to do right now um i just love her with this i love like i said the hair the skin color the eye coloring she's very 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 pretty of a doll and then also when it comes to being a doctor i feel like she looks very character accurate for what they're trying to represent now i opened up a bunch of my favorite pieces these are my favorites out of all the ones that i opened I didn't want to make this a five hour long video <laughs> going into every single piece. I picked up my favorites. I love the detail of the rose here. It looks like some, like a, it's a silk rose, obviously not a real one, but it looks like something you would get in a hospital visit. So cute. I love the detail to the crayons. Look at these crayons. Oh, evidently she really likes purple a lot, a lot. <laughs> um, mouthwash. I love the little like toothpaste and toothbrush is so cute. She has, of course, her hospital bracelet, which is a real rubbery material that actually does come off and open and can be wearable. That is so cute. And this that I thought was so awesome. It says, my secret pizza recipes, spiraled notebook, open it up, actually has on each page something different. That is so cool. That'd be fun. Maybe one day I'll go and make every single one of these pizzas. <laughs> you can even create your own in here. Oh, I love this. This is, I thought this was a really, really cute touch to the pizza playset with the outfit. Cat shaped glasses. You also have regular glasses. You, we have an actual, look at this, airline ticket, which look, it looks like a real airline ticket. It says Air OG on it. <laughs> love that. Passport which doesn't have any stamps on it yet, so it looks like she's about to travel. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> but you can fill it out, though. If you have a really tiny pen, fill it out, though. The passport. Even down to a Get Well Soon card with Band-Aids on it. Like, I just literally such a good detail to these with the chocolates. An extra mask with this one play set. So now I have a bunch of masks with all these. But they're going to be very safe. All my dolls are safe. Now, going into the outfits, we have, they're all Velcroed. Some of the Glitter Girl outfits have real buttons, so I don't know if maybe some of the OG ones do, but these don't. Now, the leopard jacket, though, is just the line. Like, it doesn't, it's not lined, but it does have really nice texture to it. Has the actual patch on there for OG. Loving the detail on the jacket. Would have liked to have seen a line, but honestly, I'm getting so much here that I don't care it's not lined. Um, there is a lot of fuzz coming off, but I think that's just the initial getting out of the package. The boots are just all rubber. It would've been cool there for on the top, but like I said, these aren't American Girl prices, so you have to think you're gonna get a rubber boot instead of one with fur on the top. Again, not mad at it because I love the jacket so much. Now she just got off work after a long day at the hospital and here is her outfit. I actually don't like the boots on, so I'm not gonna even put them on, but the tights are really nice, super good stretchy quality. Really loved how they were easy to get on. The top was super easy to get on and so was the jacket because sometimes some of these outfits just are tight. This no, slipped right on. She looks fabulous. I love her, honestly. I'm so glad I got, like, thank you so much. Again, I cannot reiterate to uh, Bat Hat and our generation for sending me this. This is just oh, stunning. She's stunning. She's absolutely stunning. And I love all the pieces and she's gonna ride off into the ambulance. <laughs> Maybe she shouldn't do that in her uh, uh, like everyday wear. Maybe when she's back at work, she'll ride off into the sunset in her ambulance. But there's so many different pieces with this. And that's one thing that I love about this brand is that they're so detailed. 